The power of water has been used for generating electrical energy in the upper Austrian region of Moln for more than a century. The river Steyr, in the valley of the same name, passes through breathtaking landscapes in the northernmost foothills of the Alps. The abundant supply of water in the Steyr is one of the prerequisites for a project that, for the moment, is unique in Europe. Durch die Errichtung des Elfitunnels im Zuge des Projektes Trichterabbau Pfaffenboden waren die geologischen Voraussetzungen gegeben, so ein Projekt zu planen. Die naheliegende 220 kV-Leitung bildet das Umfeld, den Strom her- und abzutransportieren. Bernegger has been operating limestone quarries and gravel pits in Moln for more than 60 years. The extensive Pfaffenboden open-cast quarry is 630 meters above the floor of the valley. The saddle between Geisberg, Duris Eck, and Pfaffenboden forms the second prerequisite for installing the hydro pump storage plant. This energy storage plant represents an important contribution to grid output stabilization by expanding renewable power generation in Europe. The link to the Austrian high voltage grid to supply and transport power is via the existing 220 kV transmission line directly at the planned lower water reservoir. This means that it is not necessary to build new power lines, so another important step towards implementing the project is already in place. Thanks to the existing tunnels that were built to transport materials and are 3.5 kilometers long, as well as several kilometers of drilled exploration shafts, the survey of the on-site geology is excellent. High-quality bulk Wetterstein limestone dominates this mountain range. As a result, material excavated in the course of this project can be used as raw material, so no landfills are needed. In addition, favorable rock mechanical conditions have been forecast for tunneling the underground shafts and caverns. All the necessary permits have already been obtained from the authorities as well as legally binding contracts with the three landowners and Austrian power grid AG. All of these factors add up to a project with minimum impact on the environment. Four million cubic meters of water will be held in the lower reservoir ready for pumping. 1.24 million cubic meters of water will be pumped through underground tunnels by two reversible Francis turbines with a total output of approximately 300 megawatts into the underground top reservoir 360 meters above. The four storage reservoirs have a diameter of 16 meters and a length of around 1,500 meters. The pumping process takes about eight hours. This is sufficient to provide energy for seven hours of operation in turbine mode with an output of about 300 megawatts. The overall efficiency of the system is approximately 80%. Using full-size converters guarantees a completely flexible plant concept so that power generation output can be seamlessly adapted to compensate for variations in demand. The turbines and generators are installed inside the 100 meter deep power station shaft. All that can be seen on the surface is the lower water reservoir in an existing gravel pit, the open air switch gear, and the top of the power station shaft. All the other plant components are underground. Once it has been filled with water from the Steyr River, the energy storage plant will be operated as a closed circuit system. Proven storage technologies, like the Berniger Energy Storage Plant, 
form a basis for increasing power generation from renewable sources and are therefore an important cornerstone for supporting the energy revolution in Europe. The Bernegger Energy Storage Plant, a Bernegger Group project for a reliable energy revolution. Bernegger, we move sustainably.